Hello everyone, welcome to Park Maths. In this video, I am going to solve this interesting exponential math problem that is 2 raised to power m minus 2 raised to power n is equal to 4080, where m and n are integers. And to solve this question properly and step by step, first we will write solution and then we will rewrite this question in the solution again. So the question is 2 raised to power m minus 2 raised to power n is equal to 4080. Now to solve this question further and step by step, first of all I will show you an interesting point that is the difference of these two numbers is a positive number. But the basis of both the numbers are same. So there must the m will be greater than n. So let us factorize this side. So from here we will take 2 raised to power n common. So we can write this equation as taking 2 raised to power n common. So it will become 2 raised to power m divided by 2 raised to power n minus it will become only 1 is equal to 4080. Now here in this expression we will use a famous exponential math property that is r s to power m divided by r s to power n can also be written as r s to power m minus n. So by using this exponential math property here this equation will become 2 raised to power n times 2 raised to power m minus n minus 1 is equal to 4080. Now let us suppose this difference is equal to a specific number. Let m minus n is equal to k so here we will replace m minus n with k so this equation will become 2 raised to power n times it will become 2 raised to power k minus 1 is equal to 4080 now since 2 raised to power n is an even number and 2 raised to power k is also an even number but 2 raised to power k minus 1 is an odd number. So it is even and it is odd. So here we will factorize this number to the product of an even number and an odd number. And then we will compare the even number with this even number and the odd number with this odd number. So let us factorize 4000 and 80. So we will divide by 2. So 2 times 2 is 4, 0 will become here, 2 times 4 is 8 and 0 will become here. Again 2 times 1 is 2, 0, 2 times 2 is 4 and 0. Again divided by 2, 2 times 5 is 10 and 10, uh, 2 times 10 is 20. 2 times 2 is 4, 1 will become here, it will become 11, 2 times 5 is 10, 1 will become here it will become 10 and 2 times 5 is 10. Now this is an odd number so it cannot be divided by 2. So the index or exponential form of 4080 is here 2 is power times. So we can write in index form it as 2 raised to power power times 255. So the factorized form of 4080 is 2 raised to power power times 255. So let us replace 4080 with this number. So it will become 2 raised to power n times 2 raised to power k minus 1 is equal to 2 raised to power 4 times 255. Now this is an even number and this is also an even number. This is an odd expression, so this is an odd number. 
So let us compare this even number with this and this odd expression with this. So from here we will find the values of m and n. So by comparing 2 raised to power n with 2 raised to power 4, the bases are same. So we will compare the powers. So it will become n is equal to 4. So this is the value of the first variable. Now let us compare these two expressions and numbers. So it will become 2 raised to power k minus 1 is equal to 255. So let us shift this minus 1 to the right hand side. So it will become plus 1. So 255 plus 1 is 256. So it will become 2 raised to power k is equal to 256. Now we will factorize 256 and we will change it to the exponential form. So we can write 2 raised to power 56 in exponential form as 2 raised to power 8. Now again both the bases are same so we will compare the powers with each other. So it implies the value of k will be 8. But as we previously considered that k is equal to m minus n. So here we will replace k with m minus n as k is equal to m minus n and it is equal to 8. So here we will substitute the value of n from here and we will find the value of m. So it will become m minus 4 is equal to 8. So we will shift this minus 4 to the right hand side. So it will be added to 8. So it will become m is equal to 8 plus 8 which is equal to 12. So finally the values of m and n are m is equal to 12 and the value of n is 4. So m is equal to 12 and n is equal to 4 is one of the possible solution of this interesting exponential math problem. In loss, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel for such a more interesting math videos. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. See you in the next video. Bye bye.